Well, hello, all my fluid art friends. It's Doris at DF Designs. Welcome to my Tuesday Night Live. All my viewers of awesomeness. And I'm waiting for YouTube to catch up because it's not even caught up yet. So I don't even know if you guys can see me yet. Uh, so, but anyway, um, um, let me see. Come on, come on, YouTube. Any day now. <sighs> Sorry, blowing blowing air in my gloves so they're easier to put on. I still use baby powder, though. Okay. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. Come on. There we go. Okay. i got to wait for the ad. And there it is. And come on. Ah, oh, YouTube, 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 YouTube. Oh, there we go. Now I see my XOXO. Have you ever noticed I sign my emails this way? I put that XOXO right behind my name. Because I love everybody here. Okay, anyway. Let me first say hello to my moderators. And I see Miss Linda and Miss Mona in the chat. Let's give it up for my moderators. Let's do a round of applause. I love you ladies. Thank you. I couldn't do this without you. Okay, and let me see here. I also see in the chat, oh, I'm getting leg cramp already. Um, I see Fatima, Anthony, uh, let's see, Jeff B. Hail Jeff B. I'm not doing a, not doing a, a, a Vulcan salute. Gertrude, Bettina, Deirdre, Deirdre, I, 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 D, how's that? I, I never know if I'm pronouncing your name right or not. Um, Julia Lee, hello, Miss Julia Lee. Kat Pender, Kelly Mank, Lori, Lori, um, Kles, Klesig, okay, I'm probably tearing that up too. Rochelle, uh, Madonna, let's see. Scrolling down, Dear Dra, Dear Dear duh, or dear draw. Okay, thank you, Linda. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to remember that. And I got everybody. So welcome, welcome, welcome to all of my viewers of awesomeness. Let me get back up here um, to say welcome, 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 and let's have a little show and tell. Uh, I'm gonna show the heart first because it's right here behind me. It's not a galaxy, but then I use too much paint. Oops, down, down, down. There we go. I use too much paint, so I couldn't keep the rings of a galaxy. But I still like it. It's still pretty. This, I, I don't know what to call that. I know what that is. And it even cleared out of the holes, so I don't have to put a pen or, a, or something down in there to poke it out. So this one will be in the auction, that's for sure. I'm loving this right here. This is so cool. It's just, it's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, thank you everybody. And now the really awesome one that I am just so in love with. And let me turn it to the orientation I think it should be. My camera might be a little low. Yeah, my camera is too low. Um, wait a minute. Let me move that out of the way so I don't get any paint on it. Let me see. Well, okay. I'll have to pick it up to pan. Okay, this one, I am just over the moon with, okay? Um, let's see. I can't move it. I have my camera down low because of the uh, fact. Okay, and then and then here's this part over here. So what I want to do is is I'm going to bring it up for close-ups. I am just so over the moon with this. Look at that. Look at those lines. Look at those colors. Look at the different little effects. I don't know how I got this one right here. This is cool. Um. Where is that one that I really, really like that uh, now I can't find it? It looked like a little Milky Way, but I can't find it now. I even got some um, black lacing right here a little bit. 
Okay, let me turn this around. I can't go the other direction. Okay. But just look at those effects. Look at my little bubbles. Now, I will tell you, the paint that I used to make the stars was just a little bit too heavy compared to the pouring paint, so they sank. But I'm going to add more, more, more stars to make a galaxy out here, to make a, a galaxy of stars out here. But other than that, I don't see any changes I need to make on this. I am just, yes. Oh, hello, Angel, and thank you. Oh, I'm glad you got measles. No, no, these are not measles. Oh, I don't know. Are you calling these measles, cat? Or are you calling, these are the stars I tried to add. This, I don't know how I got that, but it's pretty. It's pretty. I'm very, very happy with this one. And I love the colors so much. I got two new sets of, well, they're not, I didn't get them. I had them, but I'm going to do two, two different sets of words tonight. Two different words. I got the XOXO, okay. And then I got one that says home with a heart at the bottom. Both of these can be found at the Dollar Tree, well, or as, some, or as I like to call it, the Dollar 25 tree, because nothing's a dollar there anymore. It's all a dollar 25 now. I'm trying to move some stuff, because if I can't stretch my legs out, I get leg cramps, and I was too close. Yeah, that's a little bit better. Okay, so what I'm doing tonight is, um, no previous painting. Uh, uh, let me see. I don't know what you what you're talking about, Linda. Um, now I decided I decided I'm not gonna put anything down on these because I looked at the ones I did put something down on, you know, painted it. I'm still gonna have to paint it some more. So, why even bother, you know? Because I'm going to have to sand the back and paint it so I don't even have tape on it. Um, so, anyway, this is the XOXO. Um, I'm figuring it's about 10, maybe 12 inches across from side, from end to end. And it's about... I'm going to say it's about maybe five, six inches high at this X, okay? I'm, I didn't measure it, sorry, but you can find them at the Dollar Tree. And, oh, hello, Joy B, and hello, and hello, Roxanne. Hey, Roxanne's here, and so is Joy B, yay. Oh, no, it's hugs and kisses, um... Okay, I didn't know what you were talking about, honey. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm completely confused. Okay, um, first I'm going to do my cup. Oh, man. I need a bigger studio. Let's face it, people. This place is just so small because I can't stretch my leg out. Okay, what I'm going to do is, is first I'm going to do a cup for a ribbon pour. And then I am going to put some black on top of that to give the paint a little slippy slide. Okay, and I can't see my phone behind me, so I'm going to stand my phone up over there so I can see it. Yeah, we all need bigger, right, Cat? Well, that's, you know, that's the struggle of an artist. Okay, so first I'm putting in... Um, oops, nope, not, not this first. Wait a minute. I got my list of colors how I want to lay it out. So first I'm going to put a little bit of black. Ah! And there went some stuff right down the back of my, the back of my, um, table. See, I need to build a little wall back there, and I haven't done that yet. Ah, something else just fell. Oh, okay, so I'm going to put a little bit of black down here, 
well, yeah, more black than I would do the other colors, okay? And I'm dropping my cap. I still got it on the leash, but I don't have the leash on the bottle, okay? And then I'm going to put some purple in there. These are the same paints I mixed up for the uh, for the big pores I just showed you. I still had some left over. And this is um, ultramarine violet. So, but I just call it purple. Okay, a little bit of purple. Okay, and then some cobalt blue metallic. This is an art, the ultramarine violet is an artist law paint. The black was uh, Creative Inspirations Lamp Black. And this is cobalt blue metallic by artist Loth. Okay. And, yep, it needs to be mixed a little bit. I love, love, love this color. And I did mix up some more color shift for this because that color goes so good next to this. So that's the cobalt blue metallic. Now some color shift. Um, if I miss saying hello to anybody, I'm sorry. I try to watch the chat. Okay, some color shift. It's the aqua flash is what it is. Uh, folk art color shift aqua flash. Okay, then I'm gonna put some white on it. All of my paints are mixed one part paint to three parts flow troll. Some of them got a little bit of water in them. Okay, there's the white. And then I'm going to do the golden yellow, which is Amsterdam Azo Yellow Deep. Okay, and I put that over there. Mix it because it, it's been a while since it was mixed. These are the paints I used Saturday, and some of them were even mixed up bef uh, for um, for my Thursday night live. Well, I went live on uh, Max World Entertainment. Uh, okay, golden yellow, magenta. This is uh, primary magenta. Well, it's ma technically it's part of its primary magenta, part of its um, by Amsterdam, and part of it is the. Uh, is uh, Montmartre magenta because I'm out of the other magenta. Okay, magenta. Some more purple on top of that. You know, when I get the color combination in my head, I do write it down so I don't have to fumble and try to remember. Right on top of that. Oh, yes, I know, Joy. Isn't that so pretty? So I'm putting some white on top of that, the ultramarine violet, and let me see, white cobalt blue, and then I'll finish it off with the aqua flash, and then some black on top of that. And I put, probably put a little bit more of the aqua flash in there than I needed, but hey, it's pretty, okay? Okay, oh, black. I almost forgot my black. I'm going to put a healthy dose of black right here because the ribbons are not going to be... <coughs> sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I forgot again. Linda yelled at me. There we go. Messages off so we don't have to hear the Roadrunner. Uh, you use Amsterdam White by who? Or Titanium White by who? Yeah. Um, okay, there's my, there is my cup. Now, let me open up my plain black. Yeah, Roadrunner, I know, I forgot, Jeff. I'm sorry, y'all. I didn't mean to do that, you know. Okay, I am just going to drizzle some of this on, and then I'm going to spread it out. It's going to go over the edge, but a lot of the paint, I'm going to have paint from the cup going over the edge. Okay. Okay. 
I don't want a whole lot, but then I want to make sure the whole thing gets covered. And I'll, because I'll be doing the same thing over there. Okay. Okay. I think I got enough. I think I got enough. I think I can. I think I can. Yes. This grandma knows that story. Okay. Spatula. Smooth it out. There we go. Because I'm not worried about the the um, sides because they probably will all be painted black anyway. There we go. Okay, now I need to very carefully get over here and try to put the black out on the rest of the X. There we go, there we go. And it looks like I got an even coverage. I need a paper towel to wipe my knife off. And that black is messy, so I always wipe it off. Okay, let's see what people are saying in the chat. 30 lashes with a wet noodle. Thanks, Linda. <laughs> Oh, no, that's Mona. Thanks, sis. <laughs> okay, here's my cup. Um, it's kind of hard to see it on the side, okay? But this is my cup. Now, all I'm going to... Well, first I'm going to move that so I don't accidentally get paint on the lid. For All I'm going to do is I'm going to do big ribbons until the cup... I'm waiting for the color. There we go. Now I see part of the color. There we go. And I'm trying to leave a little bit of black negative space, but I don't think I'm going to get that. Because <laughs> I got way too much paint in this cup. So I'm just going to keep going back. There we go. There we go. Now I want to get some of this color over here where most of the black came out. And I still have color in there. So let me get a little bit of that color over here. Maybe separate right there with the color. Separate right there with the color. Ooh, I like this. I like this a lot. And, of course, pretty, pretty cup. Let me see. Yeah, there we go. Pretty, pretty cup. Okay. Cup can go over there because I'm done with it. Okay. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to torch. Um... I'm trying to read the chat. Mona, I didn't blame her. I did not blame her for anything. Okay, making sure I have no bubbles. I really don't think it needs to be tilted. Turn off. <laughs> My torch doesn't want to turn off. Okay, let me stand up so I can bring it up. And go underneath and wipe off drips. Okay. Because I can tell you, I'm going to have to paint the sides black anyway. So I figured, why paint it beforehand? So this one turned out, I think, really, really good. I like the little effects that are in there. I got some little tiny cells. I don't know what those are. And I'm very, very, very happy with it, okay? Very, 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 very happy with it. Okay, now this is not going to be that long of a live tonight because I have a class in uh, a little over an hour from now. Um, I do have I do have a, a um, um, 
and an, another announcement to make. Well, besides the classes, I'm now scheduling classes. I think my next one's going to be maybe not this Saturday. Oh, I don't have a calendar in front of me. I, I still got 2022 up. Um, I'm going to schedule one of my classes on a Saturday in the middle of the day because I got somebody I want to come, but 8 p.m. is his bedtime, so. <laughs> and, um, and you don't need the cups to be at the class, okay? I mean, if you, if you win the cups, good. If you don't win the cups, you can still use a bottle bottom. Okay. Blue or purple, it's a winner. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Gertrude. Um, thank you, Angel. Thank you, Roxanne. Thank you, sis. Uh, okay, let's see. Stop sniffing the flow troll. I'm not sniffing the flow troll. No, 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 no. Okay. Now, I am going to do... Let me see if I didn't drop all my bottles down. I'm going to do a different color combination. I'm going to use my turquoise in it, my ultramarine blue, uh, my crimson, which is in this cup right here. Yeah, I got enough in there. And my white. And my color shift. And let's see what else. Yep, that's all. I don't use any black in this, but I do put a black background down. Okay, now let me see. I'm going to fill my cup over here and just push this off to the side real quick for now. Okay, so first I'm going to put a little bit of the color shift down. Okay. Well, a little bit. I love this color. I can't help it. I'm sorry. And then I'll do some white on top of that. Excuse me, Mona. If you hear my nose sniffling, it's because I got allergies. No other reason but that, okay? Okay. Um, turquoise. Let me shake this up because ah, I haven't used it yet today. So I'm going to put some turquoise. <laughs> a little splotch just came out. I'm surprised. Okay, a little bit of turquoise. And let me see. And then some ultramarine. Shake, shake, shake. Y'all are going to get sick of that song at these classes because that's a song I sing when it comes to shaking up your uh, glue and water uh, pouring medium. Because that's the easiest way for me to mix. Okay, now I'm going to put some crimson on top of that. And I haven't used it yet, so stir, stir, stir. Okay. There we go. Some crimson. Wipe it off. Okay, crimson, some more white. If not Floetrol, what, what then? Okay. <laughs> oh, you guys are so funny. Okay, some white. Let me see, white, color shift. Wipe that rip off, color shift ultramarine on top of that see the, the the people that are going to the class later y'all are i'm using um the first color combination i'm actually using it in a fiona flower uh ultramarine turquoise come on there we go turquoise Okay, let's see. Turquoise color shift. This tur color shift looks really, really good next to the turquoise in this, and next to the uh, um, the um, cobalt blue metallic in the other one. Turquoise color shift. Uh, ultramarine again. Ah, oh, look at this. I'm getting a lot of paint in here. Oh no. 
I'm going to have way too much paint for this canvas, I think. Uh, ultramarine. But I'm going to keep going with my color combination. Okay. And then uh, crimson. And this crimson and the turquoise together kind of reminds me of um, something from Dr. Seuss. Um, the turquoise and the and the red and the white. Let's see. Oh, hi, Ernie. Oh, you're fine. You're fine, Ernie. There's always replay a little later. Sorry. <laughs> Somebody better tell this bottle it has bad manners. <laughs> okay, let me move all these out of the way. That bottle is just, ah. Oh. Yes, these blues together are to die for, Bettina. Let me tell you. Okay. I'm going to put you over here. I'm going to put you over here. Now, what I'm going to do is, is I am going to move. Um, shoot. I'm trying to move it over just a little bit. Okay, there we go. And then I'll move this over just a little bit. Ah, oh, almost knocked over my, almost knocked over my, um, um, my cup. I don't need to do that, do I? After I just filled it. Okay, let me put my phone right there so I can see it. Ah, there's my black. So now, I'm going to put my black on here again. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to have, if, if I'm going to have too much uh, paint for this. Okay, there we go. There we go. Because I was trying to keep negative space, but when you got almost five ounces in a five ounce cup, and you got this little piece right here you're trying to, trying to put the paint on. <sighs> That was just way too much paint. Okay, let me add some paint right here. Okay, got that. Put you over there. Find my spatula. Make sure George didn't take it. Um, Hail Trey, nice to see ya. Promise, 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 I will get over to your channel. I have been prepping for a couple of days for not only this live, but I also have a class later tonight, a private class. I mean, it's a free class, but I figured it would be easier to make it private so I'd only have to talk to five people at once, okay? And also private because that way... They don't want, you know, they don't want everybody to see it. So, I'm doing a class tonight. And on, I do have it set up already. If you, I don't know if you've been putting the ad up or not, um, Linda. But I do have my auction for the um, end of the month set up. It's my VOA auction. Everybody, and I mean everybody, gets a $20 credit, which is my Christmas present to you. So, you could you have to pay the shipping, but you could end up getting some paintings for free, you know, just paying the shipping. Okay, I'm going to put my knife over there, put that empty cup right there. Okay, so, here's the cup. Um, it's kind of hard to see. the. I can't tilt it any more than that. <laughs> you can't see the side, so sorry about that, y'all. Okay, now, I'm basically going to do I'm trying to get this a little bit better on camera I'm going to do a ribbon pour but I'm going to do big ribbons there we go it's all my galaxy pour colors I used in my paintings but I'm using it for a ribbon pour now 
This is the same color combination tray that I did in the painting that Sci-Fi Nation wanted. Okay. Well, it's not a galaxy because I have no negative space, but that's okay. Okay, that's enough. I got some nice pretty little effects right there. So, before I pick it up to wipe the bottom, there it is. Let me torch. I am going to bring it up so you can see it because I've got to do the drips underneath. But also this way, wait a minute, I don't want, I don't want it to, um, to drip on the other one. Okay. I could have a little bit of it come this way. And yes, I see some dippled bold cabochon parts in there. That is just so pretty. Uh. And I do have a video, it's in my tips and tricks uh, playlist on how to make how to uh, make the cabochons into necklaces, which is a little bit more complicated than magnets, okay? Okay. Um, shoot. I'm trying to get it out of that paint. So let me let me do this. Let me see if this will get it out of the paint. I want, don't want to mess up too much of that paint. Yeah, that's that's just about on, all on camera. Uh, let me let me move this over just a hair and get this under there just a little bit more for better support. Well, sorry that it blends in with the paints, but I have no way to show it otherwise. So, these are my Galaxy Pour Colors, and I'm very, very happy with the way they behaved on here. Gave me some really funky looking designs. Um, this one right here, it's got, let me see, if can I pick it up? Can I pick it up? Um, come on, there we go. Um, it's got, okay. It's stuck. There we go. It's got some really funky designs right here where the H and the O come together at the bottom of the H. And it's got some really cool ribbon effects over here on the E and the heart. So I'm very, 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 very happy with these. I think they turned out gorgeous. I mean, they're not masterpieces, but I wasn't going for masterpiece, okay? I was going for pretty, you know, because the, I can't expect every one of them um, to look like um, masterpieces, like the colors did last, last uh, Saturday, I swear. Um, let me, uh, yeah, I got enough time. Let me, um, well, first, let me put, put the lid back on this so I don't spill anything in there. And what did I just touch with my glove? I just touched something over there. Shoot, 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 shoot. I accidentally touched the top of the X with my glove, which I did not mean to. Okay, um, put you over there. Um, I wanted to bring it back, the painting, for those of you that came in came in late okay um the one painting that i was just over the moon ecstatic with okay there's the other cup um because it just i don't know how to put it it just turned out perfect and so i can get a better view of it let me excuse the mess on either side of the tray let me bring yeah there we go let me bring my camera up 
and show off this baby one more time for those of you that came in late. This was the big 12 by 24 that I did. Okay. I think the orientation is going to look better like this. I don't know. You all tell me what you think. Um, shoot. I'm going to dip the paint right down in that cup if I go any lower. Okay. This is about as low as I can go without dipping into something. So, this was the one that I did last Saturday. And it turned out, this one I call a masterpiece, okay? I got effects in it. I did, don't know how I got it. But... You know, you, you, fluid art will do what it wants to do, okay? You can go ahead and add all the additives you want. Sometimes you don't need additives. This is just paint and flow troll with a little water added to it, okay? That's all it is. And it gave me some cool effects right here. It gave me some cool effects right here and right here. Now, my, my um, little splatters of paint I did for the stars and stuff, didn't exactly stay on top because it was thicker paint. It had just a tiny bit of water on it. So I'm going to do the same thing again now that it's dry and those will stay on top. So it's going to get some stars added to it. Uh, and this, this one right here will be available at my VOA auction on January 28th. Um, um, did you, um, yeah, you're right, you're right, oops, what just happened, my, um, am I still alive, my, um, oh, I'm buffering, how do you like that, okay, there we go, okay, I was buffering, yeah, you're right, Linda, they'll hang it whichever way they want, um, I'm not resining it because I don't want to get it too high of a price, but it will be varnished and it will be in the auction on January 28th, which is a Saturday. Thank you, Linda. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, my, my phone, um, was buffering. My, my live was buffering. I still got a green box, so... I don't know, it could be the weather that was making my phone buffer, because there it goes again. Okay, so anyway, listen, um, so mark mark your calendar, go do a, go, it's already set up, so go see if, uh, if YouTube will show you the, um, show you, show it to you, but Linda posted a link somewhere in the chat, um, I don't have the link, um, I don't have the link handy, but if you go and set a reminder for it, and that we'll be at, talking about it every day until until it um, comes up, and that those are going to be in the um, in the um, auction, and so are these guys. Um, anything that dries and can be varnished before the end of the month will be in the auction. Okay, where is my cap? Where did I put you at? I only had one cap, so, well, okay, I'll find it in a minute, um, okay, good night, Angel, thank you for being here, um, yes, it is, Linda, yes, it is, that's where I keep my Martians, no, um, what it is, it's a, a box at the bottom that says I'm still alive, or that I'm, um, or that I'm um, 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 not getting a good signal out, you know. So um, anyway, um, thank you very much, Linda. Everybody click on that link. That's for the uh, VOA auction at the end of the month. And I'm going to let everybody go. I've got a class to set up for. So I hope to see all of you next Saturday because I do have giveaways on Saturdays. You know, I love giving back to my to my um, viewers. And um, let me see, this is Tuesday. 
uh, throughout the week, grayscale painting, um, Garden State paint, and um, Vermont paint photo. They do lives throughout the week. And um, next Saturday, of course, will be the Moose and Crazy show with Moose at um, 3 p.m. Pacific, which is 6 p.m. Eastern. And then I come on at uh, 7 p.m. Eastern right after her. So, you guys, have a great evening. And I just got one question for one little man that I so love. Are you ready, B? B, B is Bentley. He's my, he's my, I call him my God grandson, okay? Because I love him that much. Um, so, listen, um, are you ready, Bentley? Because all I can say is, Bye for now. Love you, Bentley. Wink, wink.